Hi, this is Paul from paulbrammy.com. I just wanted to go through an entry strategy for uh, the Xprad Elgo. I'm looking at RTY here. Um, overnight, I, I'm based in Europe. Uh, we've had tests of a really strong support and resistance zone uh, on this five minute chart for RTY. And we've had two six star sell signals now. Now, the overnight low here needs to be broken for me. So when we look at entry strategies here, the first thing to do is this latest six star cell looks good. It's come to test the support and resistance zone again. So we're going to put our stop above that pivot there. The next thing to do is sensible entry strategy. It's rejected these lows down here. The lows were uh, 1587.7. OK, uh, so we need to make sure if we're going to go short uh, with this signal, we're going to go short below this rejection point here. So we put our entry in, then we work out our risk to reward. So if I just take that off and do that again on the risk reward. So remember the support and resistance zones are taken from the hourly. So when I go to the hourly time frame here, you can see uh, these are how I've produced these support and resistance zones from the hourly. We, we came, this is a really strong support zone that we've just tried to test as resistance now. So this is a strong zone. Give me confidence that if it does hold and push down, this could be a good looking trade. So when I go back to the five minute, we are looking for a risk reward to the next support and resistance zone. So I'm going to use my FIB extension tool. I'm going to click on the stop. I'm going to click on the entry price, which is 1587.5. And then I'm going to click on the entry price again, 1587.5. So, uh, so uh, with a FIB extension, we are talking uh, around uh, three clicks there. So the, the minimum risk reward I like um, is 1 to 1.6. And you can see that there. Just to that, uh, there we got about one to one, one to two into the into that zone there, which is probably a, a really good price. But if you get these zones right, and uh, if you watch the live streaming recording on my Trading View channel, uh, you will learn how to put those support and resistance zones on your sixty minute chart. Uh, so again, entry strategy really, really simple here, in that we have. Um, really good test of the support and resistance zone we've got the stop we've got the entry below the overnight lows we've got the six star cell which is the highest graded trade that you can get we just need some more momentum during the european morning we need the dax to go down really uh, but again if even if we don't breach that low going into the us pre-market and us open this is going to be a good good looking trade obviously if we push back up here before the entry and we break the stop or break the support and resistance zone, we just cancel the order. But right now the order is valid. We've got the signal on the six star, uh, the six star star on RTY in the five minute. Uh, we've worked out a sensible entry strategy. We've got a decent risk reward and we can use uh, micros for this. If this if this range between stop and entry is too um, too big for you, uh, with RTY, then go to M2K, the the um, the micro for this particular instrument. So, you know, I'm going to do lots more of these entry strategy type videos, setting up alerts, that sort of thing in the future. Uh, we're just getting going on this channel. Um, we've had trade the fifth channel for quite a long time. Uh, but again, please go to the live streaming section on uh, my profile. And you'll see the recording of the recent live streaming about how to draw these zones in. Hopefully that helps. And I'll speak to you all really soon.